Welcome back to The Restaurant Show. Joining us now, one of the guests you have been eagerly anticipating, we have Barry Levinson who joins us from the National Mustard Museum. Hi Welcome. Jessa, thank you, always good to be here. So glad to have you and I'm very excited about what we're talking about today because, well, we know I love the topic of mustard, as mm -hmm. do you. We are both mustard fans, but you've got quite the spread. So tell me what's going on here. What we have here are the gold medal winners from the 2015 Worldwide Mustard Competition. In case people think, oh, mustard, it's all the same. Not at all. Eh. We can see here in front of us 17 different gold medal winners. They're in 17 different categories. So we have sweet hot, we have honey mustard, Dijon mustard, whole grain mustard, classic mustard, pepper hot, really hot and medium. We have horseradish mustard, herb mustard, garlic mustard, fruit mustards, spirit American yellow, deli brown, exotic mustards, mustard based oh barbecue sauces, mustard based dressings. Each of these has won the gold medal. This and reminds me of yeah. Forrest Gump, the shrimp thing. You know, you've got <laughs> shrimp sandwiches, shrimp, do, 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 you, get, you just listed like a million. I know. That you didn't even know. I know, there, there's so many different varieties of mustard. When you come to the Mustard Museum, you can taste all of these uh, that we have here. Crazy. Many of them you can buy, uh, but it, it just shows the great variety of mustard. The next step will be to select the grand champion. We're gonna be okay. doing that uh, very shortly, in fact. So uh, now these are all in the running. These are all in the running. We have already had next. two rounds of mustard tasting. Oh my gosh. With about 80 different judges narrowing down over 250 mustards from all over the world. We have mustards here, uh, gold medal winners from Japan. We have a gold medal winner from Sweden. We've had entries from Germany, from France. Oh. We've got, uh, in fact, we have a couple of French mustards that have gold medals as well. So that's going to be the task ahead. Uh, and when you come to the Mustard Museum, next time you come, you will find out who the grand champion is. It will be one of these mustards. And these mustards have already been through the ringer then. Yeah, so these, been, yeah. these guys have been through rig rigorous testing to they even have. get to this yeah. point in the competition. So, mm -hmm. They've This is like the Miss America. These are all our states represented, right? That's They've right. already done yeah. the swimsuit competition. Yeah. It's going to be talent. a best of show because <laughs> how do you compare a sweet hot mustard with a garlic mustard, a deli brown mustard against a That's honey impossible. mustard? Or, yeah. Now, are there any that you might like to taste? Oh my gosh, well, one of my, fa I love sweet mustard. Okay, so I, how about a honey I, mustard? Yeah, let's do the honey mustard. Okay, let's taste this one. Okay. This is actually was a former grand champion. It is Robert Rothschild raspberry honey mustard, so take it a dip. It even looks pretty, okay. And this so has honey lots dip. of honey. So, and when you come to the Mustard mm. Museum, you can taste that. What do you taste? I love it. Yeah, it just, just tastes sweet, honey, delicious mustard. That's so good. With a dip. hint of raspberry. That's the dip of dips. It's that gotta is be. A, yes, the dip to dip. Dip right. to dip. I right. love that one. Uh, uh, anything uh, else you might like to taste? Well, I'm a huge fan of just classic yellow. Okay. So I want to try the American yellow and see what that's like, if I may. You certainly may. This is from Ray's. It's called Downey Schooner Mustard. It's from Eastport, Maine, mm -hmm. uh, about as far east as you can go in the U.S. And this is a gourmet yellow mustard. A lot of people have no such thing as gourmet yellow. Oh, yes, disagree. There it is. Let's find Try out. That. Okay. Have a taste. I love the smell of this. You get mm. the turmeric, the little, the little spark that you get from ye real yellow mustard. This brings me back. This is a way better version, but. This brings me back to my days. I went through a very serious mustard phase where I would dip everything in just plain yellow mustard. And there's nothing plain about this one though. Now I've moved on to you know more interesting mustard, mm -hmm. but that is not plain. It is amazing. Isn't I love that one. Yeah, that's a great. You put that on a hot dog and it, it yeah. just sings. Raise. Um, absolutely. How about a fruit mustard? I bet fruit. You, I know you love. You know fruit I like mustard. my sweet. Yeah. Yeah. This absolutely. is on the sweet side. This has got apricot and ginger in it. Okay. So you Ooh. come to the Mustard Museum, it's called Saucy Mama's Apricot Ginger Mustard, made uh, out on the West Coast in Oregon. Okay. And you're going to get uh, hints of ginger and apricot mm. going on here. Oh my God. I see why these are winners. These are outstanding. Yeah. I, that's got, oh, I don't know, that one's better or the honey. 
That's a tough one. That would be a tough one, which is why uh, ranking them to be the grand champion. I don't know how. It takes about a half hour for judges, and we'll have chefs from mm -hmm. the Madison area, food writers, and uh, all kinds of mustard lovers that's really coming good. to taste Saucy that. That's really good. Saucy Mama, that's what that one is. Oh, my God. Yeah. And these are all available at the Mustard Museum. And when you come to the Mustard Museum, you can not only learn about mustard, you can sing about mustard. Heck, yeah, you and can. And one Let's of our it. favorite songs is <laughs> Yellow Mustard Jar. Let's In go the town it. where I was born, lived a man with yellow cars. He drove them all to hot dog stands. In the land of mustard jars, so we rode up to the sun, where we sat down at the bar, and we found our paradise. In our yellow mustard jar, we all live in a yellow mustard jar. Yellow mustard jar, yellow mustard jar. We all live in a yellow mustard jar. Yellow mustard jar, yellow mustard jar. Well done, well done. You want to taste another one? Yeah, absolutely. Let's take, no, I'm going to pick one that I think you're going to okay, really like. Okay, surprise me. This is the exotic mustard winner. It's from France, and it has walnuts in it. You're not allergic to walnuts. No, I love perfect. nuts. Let's, you're gonna let's try it. You're going to love this one. Walnuts This is in one particular. that is the star of Mrs. Mustard's famous triple walnut salad dressing. You take this walnut mustard mm -hmm. with a little walnut oil and a nice mild vinegar. You're teasing me. Let's I go. Know. Go. Taste that one. It's going to have a little bite. Mm. You get the it's walnut. It's a zip. It's got zip. It's got and it's some got zip. Lots of great walnut flavor. It does. Mm. I like it. Isn't it great? I like it. I wasn't yeah. expecting it to have that kick, right. but it does. It's it does. Very it's good. Got a great kick. So these are all mustards that so you that can taste. So that wins the exotic category. Yeah. You can taste all of these mustards at the World uh, Mustard uh, Competition, mm -hmm. and of course at the National Mustard Museum, where How it's mustard, mustard, mustard every day. Mustardy fun over at the Mustard Museum. Thank you so much, Barry, for joining us and sharing all these fabulous winners. Can't wait to find out who the grand prize winner is. Check it out at the Mustard Museum and stick around for more restaurant shows.